Isn't this dress nice? Nice warm material too. It's made in Iran. May not seem like a big deal now, but Iranians remember a time when they could hardly grow their own food. The years following Saddam's attack on Iran. That's why it's a big deal that in only 40 years following Iran's Islamic Revolution, the country is self-sufficient in many different areas. Iranians can now produce a wide variety of different goods, including quality agricultural products, chemicals, foodstuffs, medicine, cars, well, maybe not quality cars just yet, but hey, without the prospect of war, Iran will be able to improve that too. Because as long as Iran's homemade missiles can fly far enough to hit certain military bases if necessary, the chance of Iran being yet another victim of an American or Israeli invasion is minimal. And these products are not all Iran can make. Iran is also a leading country in sciences like nanotechnology and stem cell research. Hundreds come to Iran every year to benefit from the country's advanced and affordable medical services in areas like fertility and optometry. Iranians have also been fairly successful in enhancing technology with tradition. Plant-based Iranian medicine is fairly effective with little to no risk. Meds like this one, the world's only plant-based Alzheimer's medicine. Now the question is if this sanctioned country has been able to resist American demands for 40 years, can other countries as well?